making sure everything's working in the PA right now. No, no, I get it. It's okay. It's okay. He always plays the same song, so he knows what it sounds like. Oh, God. It doesn't take too long. So while I'm waiting, you. What now? Want a freestyle? Hello! Hello! From the uh, uh, New Mutants. How about that? <laughs> awesome. Because I vote for a Melvin's cartoon. Guy I mean, Fox. Guy, Guy Fox. <laughs> what would you like to tell the readers and uh, listeners to uh, rock and roll industry? Something that nobody ever asks and you just really want to get out. Well, I'm going to be burning desires in that department. Uh, uh, Nothing sexual? Sexual, no. <laughs> Not your deep dark Something secret. should never be said. <laughs> Some people shouldn't breathe. <laughs> True. Uh, so, nothing. Okay. Oh, nothing I can think of is that dramatic. I mean, uh, um, one thing I like, I would really like people to ask me is, is uh, ask me if it was okay for them to pay the check at the restaurant. 
or if it's okay for me to get all my stuff at Guitar Center for free. That never oh, happens. Well, we can get Is you it okay if we don't me. charge you? <laughs> that never happens. No, I mean, come on. Give the man a break. I mean, after all, he's done the all I've done. Yeah. What do you want me to do? I know, but... The least I can do is nothing, but I do more than that. I hate to bring it up, but you have a birthday coming up next year. With what number is that? What birthday? Uh, uh, my last birthday. So my birthday? Yeah. yeah, so I'm going to be 50 years old. Are you going to bourbon tonight? The wife's no. not with me. I don't drink. So. Oh, great. I would never ever recommend bourbon. The locals go to Frenchmen to listen to some good jazz. And, uh, yeah, no, I, so. can't, I can't imagine going anywhere after uh, the, except for back to the hotel. Okay, he's going back to the hotel, though. Uh -huh. And we are looking forward to your show. Thank you very much. You are so the much well, we were in Christchurch uh, a couple years ago when they had the big earthquake there. And uh, actually, we didn't know it at the time, but as it turned out, the club that we played the night before was totally destroyed. It's a big earthquake. We live in California. We've been through earthquakes before. We knew exactly what it was when it hit. And it was a pretty good sized one. Um, we were lucky to get out of there. It was okay, chaotic. And uh, managed to then van and drive to the northern part of the island and, and take a ferry the next day across. And that was a pain in the ass. They flew us on an emergency flight for people who had been put out as a result of the earthquake, which we certainly weren't. Uh, it's not the kind of thing you get over. I don't know that I'm, I'm all, all ever get over that kind of thing. It's, it's uh, tragic and horrible, and um, you know, I, I don't want to go through those kinds of things again. Could be worse. Yeah. So we have been the Melbourne. Uh, 16 by 25. The, uh, uh, me and Dale have been in major earthquakes in uh, three different parts of the world. That's kind of be part of some weird club. So California, Christchurch, New Zealand, to and Japan. Tokyo. Yeah. 16. That's crazy. Uh -huh. Most people, some, most people were never ever in, in any earthquakes, you know, mm -hmm. let alone big ones. We oh, were in we completely for a long time, so we went through all those yeah. big ones there in the last 20 years. You ever been near to any other natural disasters? Have you been here for a hurricane? No, <laughs> but you can drive north and you know, I got three days or whatever it is and know it's coming. Do whatever it takes. I mean, if you if you decide you want to live somewhere where there where there's no natural disasters, I think it's uh, wise to probably take some sort of precautions and be prepared for it. If you live in the fire zone, you should do that. Or we live in California. We realize there will be another earthquake at some point. So I'm not going to be surprised by it. Hopefully it won't be too bad. You know? mm -hmm. um, and here, you know. But I mean, if I knew the earthquake was coming, it would be a little different. A little different. It doesn't mean that everybody can do that. But I think I would have an easier time with a disaster I can see coming than I would a disaster I don't know when it's coming. You know? Right. <laughs> Maybe. But I've never, I, I have no idea. I've never lived anywhere like this. We don't get hurricanes in California. I think they would be called typhoons. <laughs> I mean, you know, you can't live in fear. I mean, right. you will to some degree. Whatever. I mean, it's just, these things happen. Traveling and seeing the world and what goes on in the world and does it come out in your art? Um, if anything, all all the traveling and all those kinds of things make my life even simpler. You know, mm -hmm. uh, it doesn't take much to make me happy. You know, I'm a fairly complicated person, but. But in reality, I don't really need much to be Mr. Nice Guy. Your group is very fun, and you can come off as very big and outrageous, but you seem to be an extremely humble person. Um, you don't want the big limelight and the big shows or the big arenas, or do you? I'd take half of that in cash. Yeah. <laughs> Fame is really yeah. the worst part of the whole thing. I don't really right. care. I mean, I'm into promoting my band and everything like that and to the best of my ability. I don't run away from it, but um, being famous, is it something that, I, that I'm pretty, that I'm super excited about? Right. It's I okay, but ultimately I don't want to have. Uh, I, 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 I like to work. And right. That's part of the deal. Right. I. That's I, how it goes. I hear you, and you like to take care of your family. I'm assuming. 
Well, yeah, my wife would have very little tolerance for me not working out. <laughs> as well, for sure. In the early days, for years and years and years, not making any money, not unlike most musicians. You know? It's a money losing proposition, basically, for most people. I would say 99% of the people out there never put two and two together and are able to put one dollar ahead of another one and turn it into more dollars. It just never happens, even on a lower middle class level. Mm -hmm. Most people get disillusioned and quit or they fall into drugs and alcohol and things like that and that burns them out faster than anything else. Um, uh, we're no different and, and, and we've all had uh, problems along those lines with band members and all sorts of things and, and because it, weird, as weird as it might sound, the most creative people that I've ever been around are usually screw ups somehow. <laughs> and so they don't have it together in a lot of areas. So if you want to deal with people that are a great musician, that means they're going to have that, that all that power in that spot takes power away from something else. You know, yeah. sometimes you generally you don't find perfectly well-rounded musicians who have it together in every aspect of their life. That's really <laughs> happening. You know, we came out of nothing. Me and Dale certainly are um, below lower middle class. My parents uh, uh, were um, working class and certainly worked their whole lives and don't have a whole lot now. You know, I mean, but it's, it's fine. I mean, that's not different than anyone else. You know, most, the vast majority of people in, in this, in the world, you know, live paycheck to paycheck. And that's that nice. Kurt Cobain's favorite band? Look where it got him. I mean, eh. Dead. But I mean, come on. I mean, that's one of the biggest honors I think could possibly ever. Well, to be perfectly <laughs> honest about all that, to me, there's no good side to any of that. It's a tragedy. And if uh, his association with us in any way hastened his death, and I think it's the worst thing that could possibly have ever happened. Oh, no. Absolutely. I wouldn't blame you. I don't blame me. I just mean there's no good side to this. Mm. I can't look at the good part of right. it. Drug addiction and death. Right. You know? Ten seconds left. Thank you. We love you. Everything's good. We're excited about tonight. Me too. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.